What is going on you guys? My name is Sodis. Welcome to Keisuke's Mazda RX-7 Stage 1 Vehicle Tutorial. Now, I know some people requested his this, this car as well with the Stage and the Stage 4 vehicle. Um, but right now, I found a crew color that matches, you know, his exact Stage 1 vehicle color. Um, a competition yellow Mika. This is what the hex code is right here on screen. Um, this is for the car if you guys know how to actually put in a crew color straight up into your crew itself on the social club website for GTA 5. Um, if not, I'm going to go ahead and link a tutorial on how to do that in order for you guys to get this crew color. Or if you guys would like to, go ahead and join my crew. Link is in the description below. It's free to join. Um, this will be the crew color that is up um, on the site when you join the crew. And in order to select this crew color, what you need to do is you have to make sure you join the crew. And when you set active crew, then you go into GTA 5, select the crew color, and you guys will get this color. It'll be the competition yellow Mika for his Mazda RX-7. So let's go ahead, get right into the build. So you guys are going to want to slap, um, you know, whatever armor choice on. It's not going to matter to the competition, you know, of the car. Um, no weight, you know, just, it, it doesn't matter. It won't add weight to the car. So armor is your choice. For, uh, for the brakes, you guys will want stock brakes. Uh, for the bumpers, you guys are going to want to select the stock front bumper. Whatever you desire. Technology then you guys are going to want to slap on the stock rear bumper. I don't know why I said slap on. You guys are just keeping it normal. Engine. Engine block. You guys want to keep this stock. Air footage. You guys are going to want to put on the prime turbo air intake system. I don't even know what the hell is wrong with my voice today. Strut brace, light and racing strut brace, engine tunes level four, and then you guys are gonna want to have no intercoolers. Um, exhaust, street exhaust. Life is hard when you can have these ones right here. These are basically like the actual exhaust of the car itself, except it's a single, not a double. Fenders, you guys will want to have stock front fenders. And then you guys are going to want stock rear fenders. For headlights, uh, stock headlights. There's going to be no hood catches. And then you're going to have a stock hood. A horn, that's going to be your preference. Interior. Dash, stock dash. Dials, single ta uh, taco. Single taco dial. Single tacho dial, my bad. Stock doors, carbon tuner seats, Bubbles or something? steering wheel, you guys can go for apex basic or you guys can go for the sprint basic, but mainly his looks more like an apex basic, so put on the apex basic, uh, no roll cage, lights, headlights, you guys are going to want to go ahead and stop by the LS car meet um, and to the mod shop and you guys are going to want to slap on white lights or go ahead and head over to your mod shop at the arena war and slap on white lights there. Um, neon kits, you're going to have none. Uh, no livery, kind of disappointing. The car would look so much better if there was liveries, you know, for, meant for the car itself. You know, I, I mean, I wish they put on the actual livery from the Banshee um, 900R or whatever, you know, the Benny's car. Basically, the closest livery to it. No louvers. Mirrors, those are going to be stock. Plate, uh, you guys are going to want to put on blue on white 3 and select whatever, you know, if you have a custom plate, whatever you have. Plate is totally your preference. Um, respray. Now, if you guys aren't going to do the crew color, um, go to respray. Go to classic and go to race yellow. So you guys will just choose race yellow. It doesn't look that bad either with the race yellow. And then you guys are going to want to do the same for secondary. Race yellow. Now if you guys want to experiment and see if you could try to get the same color as this with, without you know with the whole crew thing. What you could maybe possibly do is go to metallic 
choose the race yellow itself and choose a white pearlescent like um ice white or frost white maybe um just you know just kind of experiment and see if any of you guys come up with something leave it in the comments below if you do um but for trim color you guys want red accent color you want torino red stock roof for the skirts you're gonna keep it stock no rush at all no rush at all splitters you're gonna have stock splitters optional spoiler for the spoilers you're gonna have no sun strips suspension is totally your preference but um for, for you know for slidey purposes in drifting um i'm going for competition suspension life is hard when you can have anything for taillights you guys want stock transmission slap on the highest that you have so for me i have race transmission turbos got turbo tuning and then the wheels now i do want to talk about something about the wheels some of you guys may not notice this unless you guys are huge initial d fans but on his wheels you can see the little um bolts on the rims i think i don't know what those are um but to get these wheels this is basically an initial d reference they added another initial d reference into the um the new update these are speed boy wheels these are basically case case wheels in the show itself um from their basically their main theme song in initial d speedy speed boy I'll link it down in the description if you guys want to listen to the song so you guys know what I mean. But these are basically the wheels meant for his car, Speed Boy wheels. Um, now you guys can slap these on or if you guys want, I believe it's in street. It's not in street, it's in sport. You go to sport, go to stock rims, and you can go to Wang and Master. Or you can go to uh, Speed Boy rims in the track, the new wheels. And now enough with that. Color obviously is going to be alloy. Windows, light smoke. And that's the car. Now, it's it, I'll go ahead and take it out to the night just so you guys can kind of see the color since, you know, it looks really bright right now in this kind of room. But overall, it's a really nice color. This is basically his color in, you know, Initial D, his actual car color. Competition Yellow Mika. Mika, Mika, whatever you guys call it. It does not look that bad at night either. Knowing for night street racing, downhill street racing. See if I could drift in it. Kind of been getting a little bit better in the RX-7. I do not have low grip tires on either. If you guys are wondering. So that's going to go ahead and do it for this build. I don't know how many more initial D car builds I'll do unless if you guys have any requests. Go ahead and leave them in the comments below. But anyways, I hope you guys have a great rest of your day. Stay safe. Drinks lots of water. Peace out. It's been Sodies. Love y'all. See y'all later.